Not everything you see in movies depicting CIA is fake. Take dead drops, for instance. It's actually a common form of communication used by CIA officers and their assets in the field, especially in high counterintelligence areas, where it's too dangerous for them to meet in person. Our officers will place messages, or say film, in a concealment device. They'll put it in a predetermined location, known as a dead drop, and then the asset will come and pick it up. When we're creating a dead drop concealment device, we want to make sure that it's something so common that it will blend in with its surroundings or make it so disgusting that no one would ever think to pick it up. Take this rat, for example. Disgusting, right? No one would ever want to pick up a dead rat. And so our officers in the Office of Technical Services thought this would be a great way to conceal things. They treated the rat, they cut it open, and created a cavity. And this way our officers could put things like money or one-time pads, um, even film inside here, sew it up, place it at the dead drop location, and then the asset could come and pick it up. Foolproof, right? That's what we thought. But we just figured we were worrying about humans picking up our rat. During the testing phase, cats started stealing our rats. And now you've got two people risking their lives for information and cats taking it. We didn't want to abandon the plan though, so our officers actually tried animal deterrents, things like cayenne pepper and Tabasco sauce, and settled on something called wormwood oil. They would have our officers douse the rat with the wormwood oil before placing it in the dead drop location. 